Hello guys, Amy11 here, and welcome back to another episode of Earthbound. So in the last episode, um, we met the dungeon man. It was, turns out it was Brick Road, and he turned himself into a massive, walking, living tower. However, he got stuck in between some palm trees, and so now he's probably stuck there for an eternity. May God bless his soul. But, he did give us a submarine, and we're able to get over here. So now, here we are in deep darkness. And this place is interesting. So, once you start going into the deep, the deep water, you'll start to take damage. Um, it's nothing crazy. I believe it takes. How much? I think it's kind of random. It looks like it does like one or two, one to two damage. Starting with the first party member. Oh no! It does it to everybody. So it will start take start. Like ticking damage to you. And trust me, it can get, get ugly. Um, and there's also another thing here. So if you didn't grab any money from if, uh, before coming over here, um, <laughs> listen, that's the that it's not good. So what is this? Oh, hold on, hold up, hold up. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Another mole's playing rough in deep darkness. You shouldn't even exist here. <sighs> Charm coin. Don't know what that does. I think it's worth getting though. Oh yeah, if you don't have the Hawk Hawkeye, it sucks. Yeah, there's a thing called magic truffles here that a great psychic point um, healing item. It's amazing. But I've never found one. Also, real quickly, uh, talk to this guy right here. He'll give you another item though. That you can use multiple times. The monkey's love. Um, works just like the slime generator, but it does and can also do possibly a few other things. I have yet to see it. Also, um. If you want to get rid of this darkness, um, make sure you have just use the Hawkeye. I mean, you can try and go through this like this. Um, I don't recommend it. Yeah. So um, this is what I tried to talk about. Um, if you did not withdraw any money from when you were at the dungeon main, you can get it here. However. The handling fee is absolute bull. So when you take out a thousand dollars, you also have to pay him a thousand dollars. So the same amount, which, as it says here, is the same amount of your withdrawal. So be very careful. Uh, there's going to be a few point, uh, a few times where that happens, and it sucks. And look at that. And that's the only time we ever need it. After that, after this, we don't need it anymore. Obviously, I'd love to show off the magic truffles, but... Um, it's on his is right now. And he's learning the way of the star storm. So unfortunately, we won't be doing that. <laughs> um, the enemies here can be a bit tough. Um... 
Once I, we run into them, I'll give a little small description of them. Well, this place can be quite the maze. So I'll do my best to get through it. Hey, okay, I'll take beef jerky. I don't need this dining van. Also, this place can be a little bit slow trudging through it just because of the... because of the deep waters and such. Also, apparently there's a photo guy here. Why he's specifically here? I don't know. Another IQ capsule. I'm actually going to put that on Henry. Oh, hold on. That's a familiar little helicopter. It looks like Porky crashed, or Pokey crashed here. But uh, where is he at? It's completely broken. I thought I could fix it, but on a re-examination, I noticed there's no engine. He took the engine out. Now, why would he do something like that? Couple life noodles. Awesome. And here's our first enemy. The Demonic Petunia. Um, weak to fire. So, just burn it. <laughs> uh, freeze will not do anything to it. Uh, I don't know anything else about it. Yeah, it's just... Oh yeah, and he can do that. Get out of here. He can mu I think he can mushroomize you. Which you don't want here. Oh, no, no, no. You do not want to be confused here. With anything else. You'll be here forever if that happens. Right. Ooh. Can I get by here? Yes, I can. And look at this! The attack slugs! They are now pit bull slugs! They are no different than their... Um, lesser brothers. Uh, but they do do higher damage now. But they're just as weak. Just step on them. thing you can do is Psy Beta and Psy Fire them. That's another good way to take care of it. It makes very quick work of them. Cell packet. A little ironic. <laughs> and in normal means, that would have killed them having that salt packet on them. And I believe it's up here. I'm gonna say, uh, no. There's rock candy. That is very good. Um, you can use that with uh, capsules. You can get two instead of one. So you get like plus two instead of a plus one on something. I believe. 
Well, what's it with the jar of jelly sauce? No, actually, wait a minute. I'm thinking about the wrong... Uh, sorry, I'm thinking of the wrong thing. I'm like, wait a minute. So, rock candies uh, basically give you uh, a random uh, upgrade. Yeah, so it's basically any of the five. Uh, if you use a jar of jelly sauce while eating the rock candy, um, you'll get two instead of one. Sorry, I'm thinking of it like it's a topping or something, but no. Like, if you use like a ketchup packet or the salt packet that I just picked up and threw away. Um, okay, who needs a defense? You have a Talisman Ribbon. I'm gonna let you use that. I'm actually gonna give it to Henry. Have him be the tank. Oh, wait. Because he's got too much crap on him. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna have you actually equip that. That's plus 30 to defense. That's great. Since he keeps getting targeted, that would be perfect for him. The only thing that's really going to get annoying is the, the flashing. But uh, if you take the route that I took, you should get through this in no time. But also, what is this? It's belt, and he's changed. He is trained. Master Barf. Now, I don't know if the jar of fly honey actually works here. But honestly, throw everything you got at him. Just destroy him. Two thousand. <laughs> Balti bottle rockets are insane. His new power, Psy Star Storm. Just like that. Get out of here, Casey Bat. I think everyone's going to go level up from that. <laughs> I got Psy Shield Beta. Nice. I got Brain Shock Omega. Alright, I need to get out of here. Get out of this water. And look at that. Guess who's back? We're gonna give the monkey's love to him. And. Yeah, I think that's about it. Oh, and you won't need the hieroglyph copy anymore. Um, key to the tower. And a small thing about the KC bat it's a very strong weapon for. Uh, It's very strong looking for Ness or whoever named it. Look at that. That's a massive amount of offense. However, it misses it misses it has a high miss rate. So 75% of the time you're probably gonna miss with this bat. But once it hits, though, it does insane damage. Um I wouldn't really rely on it. Uh there are better weapons, especially end game weapons that can be found. Drop from enemies that absolutely make the make the Casey bat look absolutely useless also uh, we didn't run into many enemies here 
You know, they're usually swarming this place, but they're, they're not anymore. <laughs> I guess we're too strong and they, they, they ran off. And look at that. We're here at the Tendo Village. So first things first, come down here and grab this. A death ray. As an upgrade for Henry. Henry or Jeff, whoever you, you named your character. Again. But nobody here is going to really talk to you. They're, they're, they're extremely shy. However, we can stay here at the end, though. Well, you notice that everyone here is kind of shy. So, even the leader is not really talking too much. I heard there's a book that can fix shyness. There is. Where? I don't know. Just a rumor. A book, huh? Well, it's the best way to look for a book than at the library. So let's head over there. Yes. Now since we talked, this is Applicate. Hey, beautiful weather here. I'm around right now, but I'm working on my eraser eraser machine. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I talked to you with ages. This orange kid. We're finally coming here to the end of research on... He needs a boiled egg back to a raw egg. Really? He is missing. He left here saying that he's going to see when we came back, I hope. I was hoping to borrow the old book Overcoming Shyness from him, but suddenly he disappeared. I haven't read the book, so I'm not very good at talking. Sorry. Uh-oh. Something happened to Apple Kid. That's not good. But first, we need to head back to Onet. I think... It should be there, hopefully. Man, it's been a while since we've been back, here. back here. Who would have thought after all this time? Ah, I guess I'm just gonna take a map. It doesn't take any inventory space, it's just there. Yep, now we have a town map. Um, overcoming shyness. Gosh, I forgot if this is like before or after. We save Apple Kid. Huh. Huh. No, it's not here. Huh, okay, so I guess we gotta save Apple Kit first. Um, but you see, this is normally where you find the book. Um, but it's not here right now. Alright, then my bad then. Instead. We're gonna head to Winters and see what's going on. Cause that was kind of odd. Oh, he's missing. I thought he was with you. He suddenly disappeared. Very responsible. Leaves a note at least. All right. So now that we're back here. Notice that there's some enemies. There's some new enemies flying around here. That should not be here. 
The lesser mook. There's a bazooka on you. And now we have Starstorm. Uh, it's a really good move. Um, definitely use this if you're in like in a pinch and you're facing a lot of enemies. Um, obviously make sure you have the psychic points for it. But honestly, you will not see, you will find yourself not really using it that often. Just because most of the time, uh, you're, you're pretty much doing some decent damage already. But it's a good, like, emergency, like a panic button, kind of. But still, the animation of how, of what it does is actually kind of cool, though. <laughs> I love watching it. And we got the Wooly Shambler and Whirling Robo. Freeze them. Yeah, if Psy Freeze is really broken here. Uh, Wooly Shambler, I think Fire would actually work on them, actually. Um, but you know what, let's just do it. Nope, Freeze does it. Oh, Freeze definitely does it. They're out of here. the slowest one or Ness is no normally the slowest character so just to see him actually be that fast he's only at 23 26 no that's weird huh Since we're here, might as well... Oh no, where is it? I mean, why does no? I mean, just take the... take advantage. Awesome, I'm ready to go. With the power of chewing gum, he can summon Tessie. Awesome. Let's enjoy the ride. All right. And they're down here too. They're everywhere.
Oh, <laughs> I have never seen this kind of combination. Uh, let's destroy them all. Matter of fact, let's show off Starstorm. Oh yeah, it just decimates them. Perfect. Yeah, so that's what the pencil statue is for, if you didn't want to go through this. Although, there's nothing here, though, so... There's magic butterflies, but that's, that's it. This big road is no longer here. There's no one to take care of the maintenance. Alright. I'm dealt with. We'll have to go through the cave again. But most of the enemies here will actually run away from us. Because we've taken care of the... The Guardian here. So... There's no reason. And then they'll come after us. Even the Croc's scared. He wants nothing to do with us. He knows what's going to happen if he, he gets in our way. That's right, y'all better move. And here we are. And I said I'd be back we'd be back here. And Wow, there is a lot of en hold up. That's a lot of enemies. There's like nine of them. I am not dealing with that. Oh, that didn't change anything, did it? Oh, no, it didn't. That's right, y'all better get away. Yeah, that's right, y'all better get away. It seems like the bear's the only one that actually wants a piece of us. Alright, that's not bad. Get out of here. Alright, what's going on? Come on, Doc. Oh, the Doc's even gone. Oh, no. What's happened? I'm waiting for you, my master applicator completed his race race machine while he was calling you. He was kidnapped. He felt like this. <laughs> I was there as helpless. Sorry about that. Anyway, take this machine. The race eraser machine. And yes, and this time, this is the only time you'll ever need it. Well, this isn't good. Um, you know what? I do have some stuff I need to get rid of. But, uh, the next episode. We're gonna go check out the Stonehenge. Remember that huge little hole that was there? That weird patch that wasn't covered up by snow? Yeah, that's where we're going. But well, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Catch you guys later.